Hi everyone, I have finished scrapbooking my Thanksgiving Day pictures and I would like to share them with you. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. And the majority of the products that I used are from the November Scraptastic Kit Club. And I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So this 12 by 12 sticker sheet was from the kit and it is by Lori Whitlock. And you can see I did use several of these stickers, and I really like them, um, <clears throat> and I will certainly use more. So the first page looks like that, and I'll just start with this particular pocket. So it's a 4x8 pocket, <clears throat> and I have a 4x6 picture in it. Did I say that right? No, it's a 6x8 pocket and there's a 4 by 6 picture in it. So it starts with um, this particular 3 by 4 card I believe is from the um, Seasons um, Becky Higgins kit. These four corner stickers are from the sticker sheet that I just showed you. And I'm sorry if it's a little dark, it's dark outside so I tried to rearrange the lighting. I don't know if I made it better or worse. Um, this house right here is from that sticker sheet as well. And just look at the way that Madison is looking up at her mom. Look at that face. I mean, how much love, right? Oh my goodness, I just love this picture. And then I had a flare that says, you know, thankful for mommy. And <clears throat> this is actually the beginning of my day right here. I, um, I don't cook. Um, and it's not a desire of mine to cook. And my sister-in-law loves to cook and does a fabulous job. So she's the cook of the family. And we go to my, my brother and sister-in-law's house. So my job every Thanksgiving morning is to get up and go to the bakery. So I go to Calandra's Bakery. Now I don't know, um, like in New Jersey, this bakery, you can even find their like bread and rolls in the food stores in the area. So I don't know if any other areas have it but anyways it's the best so I go Thanksgiving morning with hundreds of other people and get the bread and the rolls and um, it, it's just so good so 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 good I love you know some really good bread and and for sure um, this bakery has that and this picture I took on my way into the parking lot with my window rolled down, camera ready, coming off of a major highway. And I got a pretty good picture. I was very happy with that. So then these pictures here are, this is my brother's dog, Buddy. He is huge. He's humongous. He's, I don't know, a couple years old and full of energy and loves Madison. Um, and then this is... Um, <laughs> This I got, I don't know where I got this from, it's just a little dog, probably at Michael's or whatever. Just a cute little, you know, embellishment to put in here. Um, so that's that page. So then this here, now there was another dog there, this little dog here. And his name is Rudy, and he is fast. So it was funny because I took one picture of Rudy, and by the time the camera went off, Rudy was gone. Then I took another picture of Rudy. By the time the camera went off, Rudy was gone. And then finally, I was able to get a picture of Rudy. So I had to document that because it was just the funniest thing. I couldn't get over the fact that, you know how like when you, you, you with the camera, you push it down and it takes a second or two or three before it actually takes the picture. So anyways, I had to document. Whoops, I just knocked down my light. Um, I had to document that. Oh, and this paper here I think is from maybe the October Scraptastic kit. Now this over here, um, this top paper, I think that these are actually both from the kit. Both of these papers. And I think I'm using the B side of both of them. And then here is another solid, it's like a rust color um, paper. And this I think was from the October kit. Uh, but these words, they came in the kit and as well as the, obviously the sticker here which I backed 
onto that, that rusty color cardstock as well as the pictures. And then this actually, this wood veneer is from um, a swap kit that I was in. So that's not from Scraptastic. But I really like the way that this particular page came out. I like it a lot. Um, that's that. And then this I did, this is a Becky Higgins page protector. So it has four by six on top and the bottom and then two three by fours in the middle. So I just needed to capture this is the uh, Tanya who owns Rudy and is going out with my nephew. And then I just did filler cards here. Um, and it has the little wooden house. And then there's Madison and Rudy, except you can't see Madison's face because by the time the picture actually, actually took, he was gone. Or over her face, actually. So then this is a word from the kit and some of our family members. And this, these, this is from um, Becky Higgins, that card. And then just some more down here. This is my sister-in-law starting to put food out. And then here she is here, and this is the last page that I have. And so again, these are from the kit. So this is more of like, like a mustard solid cardstock right here. And then the uh, pattern paper on top. Oh, this particular piece right here was from, I don't know who makes it, but it was purchased that Tuesday morning and it has glitter and I just thought it was really pretty. So I went ahead and this is my sister-in-law and she's getting the food ready. And I have a flare of gobble till you wobble. I put some enamel dots and then this is a four by six card. This is a sticker from the sticker sheet. And then here's the food and I have the wood veneer, some enamel dots, a little yellow heart. And that's how that came out. I love the colors. I love the fall colors. And then we're getting ready to go. And so again, these are, I'm trying to look and make sure they both from the kit. I want to say these are both from the kit as well. The B-sides again. I might be wrong on one of them, but I don't think so. Um, so another flare, another sticker, more enamel dots. I did... Um, on this one, I wanted to use the same paper that I used on the border here to um, mat the picture. So um, underneath this chevron paper, I cut it out so you can't see, you know, the hole underneath the chevron. But it only goes around like maybe that that wide. And then I adhered the chevron onto it, and that allowed me to use some paper for the pictures. So so, and then this down here is um, a 12 inch long um, sticker from that sticker sheet and a little squirrel. And that is it. That is my Thanksgiving. And I'm now going to put my November album away. And I hope that you all enjoyed and let me know what you thought. And God bless. Bye bye.